Hi guys, welcome to episode five, right? Episode five. Are you sure? Yeah, it's episode five. I don't know. <laughs> we skipped last week because of someone's fault, not mine. Mine? It was Jay's fault. Okay, so this week we're gonna do more of a lighthearted, more of like a fun episode for me. Um, because I know last week was a little bit depressing. Um, but if you want to see what we're going to be discussing, then just keep on watching. So this week, we're going to talk about one of my favorite topics, which is... Her favorite, because... I don't know anything about it. <laughs> yeah, okay, so the reason why I chose this topic is because I am like very familiar with it. I keep up a lot with pop culture and Jay doesn't. I feel like Jay only keeps up with... What? Nothing. I hate when you stare at me like that. I'm not staring at you. Okay. <laughs> okay, so Jay, I feel like he doesn't really keep up with like pop culture in the US. He really just kind of like does like the Hispanic pop culture, right? There's, there's not even pop culture in... Yeah, there is. Okay, what? well, anyways, basically what we're going to be talking about is I'm going to be explaining the Kardashians to Jay because he can see a picture of... I mean, of... I know who are the Kardashians. No, but like if I show you a picture of one of the sisters, you're going to be like, oh, that's Courtney and it's Chloe. Oh yeah, I don't know the names, but he I do know who are they. Yeah. No, you don't. I do. Okay, yeah, if he sees a picture, he'll be like, oh, that's a Kardashian, but he can't tell you the name. Yeah. He can't distinguish yeah. them. I think the only one you like know, know is Kim, right? And Kylie. Yeah, Kim and Kylie. Kim and Kylie, yeah. And he says, son las más que? <laughs> Sluts. Son la, yeah, okay, yeah. They're gonna ban, they're gonna, no van a ser ban. No, you can cuss on YouTube. No, you cannot. Yeah, you can. No, you. Are no, you sure? You, yeah. I'm oh sure. my God, Google it. Now I'm confused. Hold on. You cannot. YouTubers can now swear in monetized. You see, we're not even monetized, so it doesn't matter. I wouldn't say I'm obsessed with the Kardashians, but I love them. Like I always follow them, and I'm always telling Jay like the latest tea on them, and I explain to him over and over and over, and then he's like, "Who's that? I don't know who that is." So let me tell you. You know how they got famous right like do you know because of the sex table of kim. of kim okay so they were already famous before that not famous but they had money right they had money because kim's dad robert kardashian he was a famous lawyer and he was like the famous lawyer for oj who's oj <laughs> oh i knew he was gonna say that because he doesn't know who oj is oj is like that guy he's like a famous footballer is that a thing footballer football player where he was convicted of murdering his wife, Nicole Simpson. And Nicole Simpson was best friends with Kim's mom. All right. <laughs> He's, this is like going right over his head. But anyways, he kind of, they already had money because of that, right? And then they had the sex tape. Well, Kim had the sex tape. We, you know with who? You don't know who the sex tape was with? With Ray J. I don't even know who's Ray J. Whatever, you don't care. I don't care. I know you don't care, but like it's so like you know it's the hot gossip. That's Ray J. That's why those people makes money because you guys care too much about it. Yeah, we you do. Can, no, I love it. I feel like for me the Kardashians are like a guilty pleasure because there's so many people that hate them. Because I, mean, I don't hate them, but I also don't like. Yeah, no, but what I'm saying is there's people that like hate them and they're like, no, they're everything that's wrong with America. They're the worst. And I'm just like, I, I obviously I like them. So, you know, it's just weird you to say me. That they're not even Americans, no? No, they're Armenian, I think. They're Armenian in something. I don't know if they're full Armenian. But I What's mean Armenian? like, Armenian is like... Oh, Armen Armenian. Okay, yeah. got it. Yeah, so yeah. anyways, but what I say is like a lot of people hate them. Like they hate the Kardashians because they say that they're like, what's wrong with America? You know, people idolize them. They make so much money mm -hmm. and people don't like that, right? Um, okay, so let's start with, let me tell you who and who. I remember, okay, so you guys know that I think like the current, you know who Courtney is? 
Courtney. It's the one that's going out with Travis. Okay. The drummer, yeah, not I the know. other one. Oh, yeah. The drummer, yeah. I the know. drummer, okay. So everybody used to say that she was the least interesting to look at, like the least interesting with Kardashian. Travis Scott, right? No. Nah, I'm kidding, I'm Stop. Kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Tra Travis oh. Barker, yeah, 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 okay. No fool, yeah. So, but it's funny because like everybody says that she's the least interesting, but Jay thought that she was the prettiest one. I think she's the prettiest one. Really? Why? I, mean, I don't know. Like right now, because of her age, she's pretty. But she cause I don't know. Jay, I don't know. I. <laughs> I mean, you're not into like I the plastic, if, right? Like, yeah, I think if Kylie wouldn't have done too many surgeries, like, surgeries, then she would be the prettiest one. But, but no. Yeah. But you see, men say that, and then they look at the before without any surgery, and they're like, "Ew, who is that?" Remember, I've sh I've shown him so many like women that are famous before their plastic surgeries. And Jay's like, ew, oh my God, ah. So, you know, men lie. They say they want natural, but they don't. Watch, he's looking it up, Kylie, Kylie Jenner before surgery, and I mean, come on. And like, there's no shade, because I always tell Jay that I'm like, I'm one of those women that believes in plastic surgery. Like, if you want to have plastic surgery, then do it. It's not a problem. I just have a problem with them, with the women that say like, oh, I didn't get anything done when they obviously did. But anyways, going back to Courtney. So he thinks Courtney is like the most beautiful one. And I think Kim is the most I, beautiful one. Not the most beautiful one. No. Okay, so who do you think is the most beautiful? I mean, she's just pretty, no most beautiful. I mean, I'm talking out of all of the, the Kardashian women. Who do you think is the prettiest? Okay. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Do you see what like how confusing he is? It's not her. That's you see that's her before. <sighs> he's looking at Kylie's before pictures and he's like, no, that was her before. I just probably hear like twelve. No, years. there she was, fifteen or sixteen. Which proves my point that men right here say, they look similar. That's when she was seventeen. Because that, that was like the time that Kylie was like lip and like iconic. Like everybody was he doing everything like Kylie. Michael Jackson's daughter. Doesn't she look like one of the people from Whoville? I don't know who's Whoville. <laughs> the, the Grinch. The people from Whoville that have like the weird face. Oh, no. I think she does. I love Kylie also, but I feel like she's had just like so much work. She kind of looks different now. She does, yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay, so anyways, I have been so obsessed with Courtney because, and I, I literally told Jay the gossip the other day, so he might remember. So remember I told you that she was, Courtney was dating Scott for years, mm -hmm. and for years he was just like not doing what she wanted. He was like doing drugs, he was in alcohol. The party guy? The party guy, yeah. I, I was telling him that Scott gets paid to party. I and Jay was like, again. I want to do that. <laughs> but like, he's old and like, you're old. Like, it's too late. I feel like if you were 18, then that would be okay. But how do I get in? What you have to I be famous up? and you have to like be known. Ah, he started. He's only, I feel like he's only famous because he was dating Courtney. But like, and obviously he has kids with Courtney, right? But anyways, what I was going to so, is like. Oh, that's the one that I like, right? Yeah. Courtney, call me. <laughs> She's super in love with Travis. It's okay. I'll be, I'm better. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> I'm kidding. But Travis, it's fine. Um, okay. That's what I was going to tell you. I love Travis and Courtney. I feel like they're so corny. What's that? Oh. Corny, like son muy. ¿Cómo se dice en español? Um, like. Is that, isn't it that word cursi, algo así? Oh, yeah. ¿Cómo así se dice? Yeah. I love corny stuff, you guys. Like, I love it so much. And I feel like they're so corny. Like, have you seen the post? Like, I always reshare her post because Travis, like, does all these things for her. You've seen them, right? Yes. That's, like, you me hinting. Me, like, the beach. He was doing everything. I don't know why. I, like, reshare it so yeah, that somebody okay. can get an idea. And he just looks at it and he's like... Mm. 
Bye. Okay. Ignore. Next. Next. Okay. Okay, so moving on to Chloe, which I was just telling you about the other day. And it's so funny to me, you guys, because I like tell Jay about the Kardashians like as soon as there's like something coming out and I tell him what's going on and he's like, who is this again? Who is this again? Who is this again? And I have to tell him a million times. But Chloe is the one that I told you that she's dating a basketball player. Hi. And he cheated on her right before she gave birth. She's Chloe, right? Mm-hmm. That one's Chloe. Mm -hmm. She got cheated on right before she was going to give birth. Mm -hmm. Like. Yeah, I remember those. Okay, so, and then right now, she's not with the guy anymore, but like now the guy just recently had a baby with another woman. And. Oh, yeah. Everybody, it's like. Everybody was kind of talking about the fact that, well, her, this is what people are saying. People are like, oh, she's so dumb. Like she constantly goes back to him and he constantly cheats on her. Like it's happened multiple times in the media. And I'm like, that's so embarrassing because like the whole world knows your business like all the time. Could you imagine anything that you do? If you go to like the store, the whole world knows that you were at Walmart because every, like you're that famous. Oh, she was the one that I told you that she, like, Kylie's best friend was, like, making out with her boyfriend. Remember I told you that? Mm -hmm. Okay, so right now, it's also, like, a hot topic. The like black girl, right? Yeah, her name is Jordan. What is her last name? Jordan Woods. She's the one that, like, you know, she was the one making out with Tristan. Tristan is the boyfriend, or ex baby daddy, whatever, of Chloe. But ahorita, it's like a hot topic because people are saying like, oh, like Chloe was talking so bad to Jordan saying like, oh my God, you broke up my family because like, because of you, my family broke up. So now, then like all the Kardashians stopped talking to Jordan. Like everybody, like nobody talks to her anymore, right? And then she got back with Tristan and then Tristan continues to cheat on her. So everybody like thinks that she's the dumb one because, you know, she broke up like all that for that right like isn't that crazy Stupid. <laughs> would you date chloe i mean maybe i don't know <laughs> he would totally date her you guys yeah but telling me that she just goes back to the to the guy oh okay that's what i was gonna nah, tell you i wouldn't then and i need to know your opinion on this because her thing is this she's like she has told the world like multiple times saying like I want to have a good relationship with my baby daddy because at the end of the day, it's the dad of my child and I want my child to grow up with her father. And personally, I feel like she's doing the right thing. Like everybody says she looks dumb. I feel like she, not that she looks dumb, but I feel like it's dumb of her. Yes. To go back with him multiple times. But at the end of the day, you need to have a relationship with the baby daddy because it's the dad yeah, of the kid. But she's confusing the word like relationship. Like relationship, it doesn't mean that she needs to be with him. Like she yeah. just can have like a good relation, like with, yeah, like mother, dad, son. That's it. But not to be together, like yeah, not to date him anymore. Yeah, I feel like she can get any guy that she wanted because she's a Kardashian. Like she can get any guy she wants. And she wants to keep going to like a random guy that like nobody cares about. And he's proved like a million times that he's not worth it. Who is that guy? Um, he's a, I know exactly. Nobody knows who he is, but like he's a, uh, he's a football player. I can't even tell you what oh, team he plays for. Football. That's what I mean, not a football player. I'm sorry. He's a basketball player. No. Um, he plays for, like, you see, as soon as I put, I type in Tristan Thompson, like it doesn't even show that he's a baseball ba basketball player. It just instantly says that he cheated again. <laughs> he cheated again. Mm -hmm. It says that he plays for a team called, oh, the Cleveland Cavaliers. Mm -hmm. Jay and I are not basketball people, so I can't even tell you, but I guess Cleveland, he plays for Cleveland. So she lives in Cleveland? I know that she lived in Cleveland for a while, like when she was pregnant. And then I think when she was trying to like work it out with him after the first time that he was caught cheating. But I know now she doesn't live there. Like she lives in LA again. Ah, um, well, that's why, I mean, she's not with him. Or, or yeah. Right now she stated that she's not with him. That's why he always cheats. No, but he cheats on her even when he's with her. And like, 
it's so bad and like I know it's mean of me but like I love every time that some new Tristan Thompson like drama comes out because the memes on Twitter are like hilarious and like I'll be looking at my phone and I'm laughing and Jay's like what are you laughing at I'm like it's because these memes are so funny like it's funny to people like me that follows them you know I don't have Twitter there was this one you're such a liar there was this one tweet that said like Tristan Tom there's so many but like there's one that's like Tristan Thompson is famous is only famous for like cheating nobody knows him for being an actual basketball player. like I wish I could remember them but they're hilarious anyways okay so my favorite Kardashian you know who it is Kim mm -hmm. I love Kim so much because I just feel like she's so like chic you know what are you looking at Tristan I'm just checking like how so you can know like who is who or not yeah I mean, okay. I don't think he makes money. Oh, oh okay. okay. He's estimated. Not bad, to... Chloe. Not bad. <laughs> oh, but Chloe has way more money than him. I mean, yeah, of course. Well, I don't know. What... What's the brand for, from Chloe? Um, because I know Kylie. It's a jean Kylie one. Make, good make American. That. Good American. Say, I'm a good American. Oh, well, I have never heard about it. I don't think she sells guy clothes, does she, guys? Good American? Yeah, good American. Why does he say I'm a great? Just put Good American Khloe Kardashian. Is it called Good American? I don't remember. Khloe. No, it's with a K, Amor. Mm -hmm. Amor. Cl all of the Kardashians, they're with Ks. Oh, that's true. He's so funny. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> uh, there. Choose. No, just put that. Good American. Yeah, it's called Good American. Mm -hmm. Um... Go found it. Okay. It's not hers. I mean, whatever. She's the one that like posts it and everything. And <clears throat> I haven't bought the only, like I know every sister has like their own, like either brand or like partnership or whatever. And the only ones that I bought from is Kylie and from Kim. Kylie, I used to buy all the time just because I am like a really big makeup enthusiast. Like I love makeup. And I would use, my favorite from her would really just be like the lip products. Everything else, like, uh, I wasn't too much of a fan of. I liked her highlighters and her blushes. Um, and then Kim, mm -hmm. he knows that I always buy the Skims from Kim. Actually, I'm wearing Skims right now. Look, this is the Skims. Um, Damn. I know. Um, I didn't even realize, like, we're matching because he's wearing brown and I'm wearing brown. You wanted to match me? I didn't even pay attention. You didn't pay attention to me? I just were... You just were are you guys listening to this? He didn't even pay attention to me is what he's saying. I'm not saying. saying to you. I'm saying what are you wearing? Por eso, you should be paying attention to me at all times. You we're want on to camera, fight, no? so oh, I yeah, can't... That's why. Don't, don't hit me right now. I'm on camera, so I can't hit him right they, now. But Exactly. They can't see you, how you treat me all the time. <gasps> oh my god, he's such an such a victim. <laughs> You're Look, so annoying. These... Okay. So fucking ugly. The other two, I feel like we've talked about. Oh wait, we haven't. Even... Yeah, no. But what was your point? Like, why did you decide to talk about the Kardashians? Like... Okay, so the reason why I wanted to talk about the Kardashians, kind of going back to what I said in the beginning, is because I feel like one, it's a fun topic for me. <laughs> And then, I mean, that's not the main reason, but I just feel like there's so much hate that goes towards them. Like a lot of people will constantly say, like what I told Jay, that they think that they're like one of the worst things that has happened to America. Like they think that people idolize them, like people worship them. And I, I, like, I feel like that's true. A lot of people do worship them. For me, it's more of just like a fun, like I said, guilty pleasure. Like, I mean... I like to see, you know, their outfits. I like to see their makeup. Like, I'm not idolizing them personally. I don't think I'm idolizing them. I just think they're cool, you know? Like, I like what they do. I think they're funny. It's entertainment. Like, that's what it is to me. It's entertainment. And I feel like there's so much hate that happens in the world right now where... Okay, so, yeah. Like, I just feel like there's so much hate in the world and people put so much of their energy into hating public figures. Like that's why for me, I thought it would be a good topic because 
I feel like these past couple of years, well, this past year that I haven't been working and I've been like spending a lot of like time reflecting on like myself. <laughs> Stop, why are you laughing at me? I'm not laughing at you. Then what are you laughing at? Huh? What are you laughing at? Reflecting, what are you mean? Reflecting. <laughs> I am, like I've been reflecting, I mean, I'm like a lot of stuff, you know, like how, well, my dad, has always told me like my whole life i'm the kind of person that stresses about everything all the time and my dad for years would tell me like you know stop stressing and i would be like so annoyed even jay would tell me that and i would be so annoyed that you would tell me like oh don't worry about it it's not a problem you stress for everything like you want well that's what i'm getting to what i'm saying is that like now this year that i've had time to like do nothing i'm not working like i've had time to kind of realize like you know what yeah like why am i stressing about things that have nothing to do with me or just things like that and that's what i mean like i feel like i've looked at how people get so obsessed with like a family and they have so much hate towards them and it's like things that do not affect you at all and like people are going crazy about it yeah so that's why i was just like you know it's crazy to me like that people have such hardcore obsessions and like for example i follow all of them right like on instagram and like they'll post a picture and you instantly see like thousands of comments of people being like you look so stupid in this outfit. You look so ugly in this outfit. And it's just like things like that where I'm like, isn't it crazy to know that there's people in the world that just are so hateful? They don't even know them, right? And like, they're so hateful to every, and, 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 and this would be not just the Kardashians. I mean like in yeah, general. I think that people is just. I feel like that, I mean. No sé cómo es envidia. It's jealousy, yeah. And, and like, again, this is not only for the Kardashians. This is in general. There's people that are so hateful online and, like, just comment the rudest things. I just, it's crazy to me how people, you know, let's say Jay posts a picture. For example, on TikTok. Like, if we post a TikTok, people don't know us personally. They don't know our lives. They don't know our stories. But, like, from a five-second video they'll comment like the rudest negative things and that's because like you know we're nobody like imagine them that they're like a huge powerful family like all the comments that they get yeah. right it's like and i wonder what that does to like their mental health i wonder if they i know that they've said you before they care? i know that they've talked about that they've seen like they'll read comments sometimes but to them at the end of the day if i was them i would be like I mean, I have millions of dollars. Of like, what course. do you what have? Do you think they do? Yeah, Nothing. I mean, they don't fucking care. No, but that. I mean, like, you don't think that that does affect them mentally? You don't think that, like, for example, Chloe, that every every woman that's like hateful will go and comment and be like, "You're such a dumb person. Like, why do you keep?" You know, like just things like that. I it's think like hard to read. It's hard for me when somebody tells me like, "You look weird" or whatever. You know, and then they get like thousands of comments like that. Like. You don't think it at least affects them like in some way? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. They, I don't know. It might, it might affect them. But, but at the end of the day, they're like, "Bye, it, I'm rich." No, like it depends <laughs> on like what's the topic or why. Okay. Like I don't know how. So, to explain it. I think I told you about this last last time, but like one thing. There's a lot of things that I don't agree with them on, like interviews that they've done and I've seen them post and I'm like, girl, what? For example, Chloe, that the one with Tristan, mm -hmm. um, I don't know how long ago this interview was, but they were doing some kind of interview and she said something like, oh, I hate people, you know, who complain about being fat and they don't do anything about it. Like, you know, instead of getting up off your ass and like working out and doing this, like you just continue to be the same way you are, right? And like, I see where she was going with it, like I do, because a lot of people think that way. I kind of think that way too, you know, like, hey, if you're complaining about being fat and you don't like it and you wanna fix it, the only way to fix it is by working out, is by eating right, right? But what she, like, everybody was upset with her was because they're like, what do you mean go work out like she didn't go work out like she got her body done like she got lipo she, she did everything you know so that's why people were like who are you to tell me like oh why are you being like just fix your fat by like working out and everybody's like girl 
you didn't fix your fat by working I mean, out. Like yeah, you I did mean. surgery, you know? And it's like not everybody can afford surgery. That's a dumb comment, I think, coming from her. Yeah, after we have kids, I'm gonna have like a Chloe or Kim butt. Which what do you like better? What do you mean? Well, now Kim. Kim? Okay, so we're Wait, gonna go. You told me that she did a reduction. She now, did. So well, I... apparently, that's like the rumors that have been going around that she got a reduction. And I saw, I don't know if it's true, if it's like fake or whatever, but, um, oh my God, I was going to tell you something. Oh, another thing that they said that I don't agree with in a recent, I don't think I told you about this, but, what? um, I think in like a re, I, I haven't seen the episodes. Cause like I said, I don't like follow them hundred percent, but like, there's a clip where during like the last Kardashian thing or whatever interviews that they were doing, they asked them like, do you think that you're setting unrealistic beauty standards for women? like in the world, right? You, you get what it means? No. Um, eh, como que ellos se preguntaron, ¿tú piensas que les estás dando expectativos que no expectativas que no son like Oh, say it again? Uh, in English? Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, like do you ooh, do you think that you're setting unrealistic beauty standards for women? O sea, like the que yeah, ellos... I think I got it, yeah. Yeah, so do you agree with that? Do you think they are? Or no? I feel like they are because, you know, they get plastic surgery. They do all this stuff. Well, anyways, they responded. I don't know, I think it was Kim that was like, that she was saying like, no, I don't think we set unrealistic beauty standards like because we work hard for what we have, she said. She's like, we work hard, we work out, we do this, like, and we have a healthy lifestyle, and that's how we get the bodies that we get. And everybody's like, yes, girl, you got your butt done, you got your no, like, you got plastic surgery, everything, and then they're like sitting back and saying like, no, we're not doing that because we work for what we have. And isn't that like crazy, like that they just don't care? Anyways, my favorite is Kim and Kylie, right? I feel like Kim. I know everybody kind of like hates her because she like did the sex tape and everybody's like, ooh, she has no self-respect. But she's also, did you know that she is studying to be a lawyer? Who? Kim. She's done like a lot of work that has helped get people out of jail. Like she's done a lot of activism. So about like the unrealistic standards that they set, I feel like it's true that they, you know, like they post their images online and they have like, their waist like this and they have a huge butt and they have their boobs and then like men like you or even them you know they'll post selfies or whatever and it's funny because they can't tell the difference between like makeup plastic surgery all that and they'll be like oh you know it's so hot or whatever and I feel like that's why women can get insecure about it you know because like for example you're saying like oh they look so fake or whatever but then how come men follow all these women that have plastic surgery and... Because you're saying we don't, we don't know who it's with plastic surgery and who it doesn't. But it's like so you obvious. You just the same answer. Like. But it's so obvious. You know, you're going to sit there and tell me that the girl that has tits over here and like a huge butt, you think that's natural? Like it's just naturally there? Some girls that they have it naturally. Yeah. <laughs> You're so annoying. So when I get everything done, I'm gonna be like, it's natural, Jay. You can say if you want. No, I'm not gonna be one of those people. I'm gonna tell people, I'm gonna be like, I did this, guys, I got my butt done. I know you're gonna say it. I mean, of course you're gonna have to <laughs> it, but. Why, would you be embarrassed? Embarrassed for what? Because you're like, oh, I know you're gonna say it. No, I wouldn't be embarrassed. I've like famous, I always tell Jay that like, like I said earlier, once we have kids, I want to like get work done. And like, he always tells me no. Why not? Because something can go wrong and then you're going to end up like Lynn May or I, <laughs> I mean, I only want basic things done. You guys, I don't want like crazy. Okay. The only things I want done is my nose, which he's known for years and my butt. But like, I don't want to get like a BBL, like a butt, you know, I want to get like, what's BBL? BBL is como cuando te quitan no, la grasa. Like what, 
the what does it stand for? I think it's Brazilian butt lift. Oh. I think, don't quote me. Um, but basically like they get your fat out, like you see like all my fat from my arms mm -hmm. and like all of this fat that I have everywhere, they get it out and they put it into your butt so that it looks like your butt is bigger. Yeah. Wouldn't that be great? I could have a huge butt. Nice. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Oh, so now he's on board. No, I'm not on board. So then why are you saying nice? I'm just saying nice because I didn't know. Oh, okay. Well, anyways, let's, that's the only reason why I want to have kids already so I can get my body done. I thought you were going to say something. <laughs> he just doesn't want to say anything because we're on camera. Say it. Say what you're feeling. What? Say it. Say Nothing what you... Nothing you're going to do. When you're not going to do anything. What are you talking about? I am. I want to. Okay, Don't you, you want me to then. feel better about myself? Yeah. If you pay for it, then that's fine. Of course. I will pay for it with his money. Like, okay. what do you mean? What's the problem? Okay. I can find a sugar daddy if you want. Okay. But the sugar daddy would be you. <laughs> You have to pay for it. <laughs> okay, watch guys. Once I get my body done, if Jay doesn't like it, it's fine. Because I'll like it. It's not that I don't like it or not. Like, I don't know. Then what is the problem? Um, so he doesn't have a, he has a problem. Expensive. He has a problem with me getting my body done, but he doesn't have a problem looking at all the Instagram models who have their body done, right? Tell them. You don't have a problem with that? <laughs> Say it. Say something. What? Defend yourself. What? Defend yourself. What? Defend yourself. No. Because he knows I'm right. It's fucking true. Man. Okay. Yeah. That's what you want to hear, okay? You're so annoying. I'm just telling you what you want to hear. You want to hear yes, okay? Yes. Mm, okay. Okay, let me not stress out. You see, this is what, these are like my new techniques, you guys. Ah. Don't stress <laughs> out when Jay annoys me. Ah. He lives to annoy me. You stressed out for everything. <laughs> um, you start talking about Kardashians, and then you start blaming me, and then you start talking about me. <laughs> and I don't know why. Then. Well, we were going everywhere in the episode. It's fine. It's supposed to be more of a fun episode today. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Okay, so real quick, pop quiz. What? Let's do pop quiz about the Kardashians. That's wrong. What is the Kardashians' mom name? <laughs> what is it? Kris Jenner. Oh my god! <gasps> you knew that. Oh my gosh! I thought he was gonna get it wrong. She's my sugar mama. She's been sending me money all the time. <laughs> Why aren't you sharing? Because she only sent me one cent, two cents. Okay. Second question. What up? How many kids does Kim Kardashian have? I believe three. Wrong. They four. Two. Oh, four. <laughs> it's so four. Okay. okay. Last question. Who is dating? Kim Kardashian. I have told you about him all. Like, yeah, I know who you told. I know that you told me already, but I honestly, but he since doesn't I listen. don't care, no, since I don't care, I don't, I don't remember. Okay, do you at least remember who he used to date? What do you mean? Who the guy used to date? I'm what you know, I know he knows this. Remember, I told you the guy that Kim is dating right now used to be dating as that girl. Oh my gosh. Do you want me to just tell you? Yeah, because I don't, I don't... Ariana Grande! You see, like... So Kim right now... She's is dating... with a fucking boy that 20 years old or what? He's 26 or 20... I think he's my age. I think he's 27. I'm not sure. His name is Pete Davidson. He's a comedian. Mm. Okay. <laughs> he's so uninterested, but... Isn't it fun? <laughs> No. Okay. Before we go. What's up? Who is your favorite Kardashian? I told you already. No, you said who's my pretty who's the prettiest? Courtney. Oh. Well, I think my favorite's K. 
Kim. Kim. I know. Kim is everybody's favorite. I love her. She's the only one who does more stupid <laughs> than everybody else. She does a lot of stuff. I will give her that. She has a lot of like businesses and stuff. So it's just going to be weird when she like when her kids grow up and everybody is like, oh, my God, your mom is Kim Kardashian. Like she's the sex tape person. Right. <laughs> that would be funny. OK. All right, you guys. So next week again. Last week, Jay was supposed to pick the topic. You're going to come back to that. And he didn't. So let's see if he comes up with next week's topic to discuss. Are you going to think of something? Yeah, we're going to talk about business, work. Actually, we're going to talk about work. What do you guys think why people is not working right now? How do they get money to live? People are, un are unemployment are on unemployment so that's why like how are they getting money? yeah jay feels very strongly about that so that would be something good for him to talk about <laughs> but um either way you guys thank you for watching today's video it was just something a little bit more fun for us to do um but don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and make sure you follow us on our other social media channels right any I last words that. Oh my gosh, you guys, he has been uploading on Instagram. How many two days? Three. Two. I told you guys I was going to get him to update more, and he has been. So make sure you follow Jay on Instagram, okay? Yeah. Just don't message him. Don't be messaging him. Yeah, like my photos. Oh. Okay. All right, guys. We'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye. Bye. Chloe, call me. <laughs> I hate him. Woo!